Hi everyone. In the following video, we'll go over the details of how you can customize the login into your WordPress backend. Um, first of all, what you'll need to do is go to flowthemes.com forward slash flow dash plugins.com, download our plugin. Once you've installed the plugin, you will then need to access your admin panel. So let me just type in the password here. Now, you, now that you've accessed the admin panel, you can start doing the customizations. So you click on custom login, and here you'll see the areas which can be customized. So these are the, the text areas that you can customize, and here are the styling options provided to you. So you can upload your logo, you can upload a background, you can change the text, the font, and pretty much stylize the entire admin area here. Alright, so let's get started with, uh, with our welcome text. So it will be welcome Vadim. This is your website. Next off we want to click here to upload our logo. So here I have the logo that we want to use. So I'll just drag and drop it here. Click on select. My logo has been added. Next off, I want to upload a background as well. So we'll click on this button here where it says add background image. Once again, I'll just drag and drop my background into this uploader. Click on select. Now that I've added my background, you'll see it here. I can do additional customizations like changing the fonts and the color styles. So let's start off with the font styles. First of all, you can change the font family. So here's a font that I think looks nice with my logo. Um, next off, we can change the font colors. So you can play around with the fonts here. Um, you can choose any type of color you want to use. So let's just go with this one. Next off, we'll have our form font. We can change that to red, actually greenish here, which is this font here. All right, so we've done that. Let's go ahead and click on other style settings. Here we have our background. Then we have um, repeat background image if, if you have a pattern, for example. Here we have the login box. Transparent fields that can be added. We have the field border. Um, so this will be just added in red, just for visibility. All right. Here we have our button text color. So as you'll see here, this text changes. And if we just go with a darker brown color, for example, you'll see that it's been added here. So uh, you can pretty much customize this entire admin section as you wish. Uh, once you've done all of your customizations, um, just simply save all of your settings by clicking Save Styles. All right, so now that you've saved your style, let's go ahead and log out. And now we're logged out completely. And so we'll add our username, admin, and we'll type in our password. And then we can click login. So now we've logged in into our backend. So as you see, everything is pretty easy and simple. Uh, we do hope this video helps. And if you have any questions, do let us know. Thank you.